about 2,000 pounds of food waste, which is about a ton. Jessica Toth opens a composting bin at the Solana Center for Environmental Innovation, where she is executive director. For years, the center has been doing what state law now requires cities and counties to do, collect food waste and recycle it in the form of compost. Toth says the new law, SB 1383, will make a difference. It was a kick in the seat of the pants that uh, we really needed as a region to address the shortage we have in the capacity for managing our food waste. And there's a lot of food waste, an estimated half a million tons each year in the San Diego region. One big problem with landfilling food waste is methane, a powerful greenhouse gas that's produced by rotting food. Statewide, it's responsible for as much as 20% of the methane that we um, emit into the climate. Toast says composting instead of landfilling would make a big difference. The composting process uses microorganisms to break down the material, um, which is not what's happening in the landfill. In a landfill where all waste is combined, organic waste creates methane, and the valuable nutrients that are in that waste are not returned to the soil. With composting, greenhouse emissions are reduced and nutrients are returned to the soil as compost is used for agriculture and gardening. In fact, land-applied compost actually absorbs carbon in the atmosphere. The city of San Diego is one of those communities that got that kick in the pants from SB 1383. Ken Prue with the city's Environmental Services Department says they expect to roll out their expanded food recycling program this summer when San Diego residents should get their new green containers. Prue says they had to find $9 million in the city budget to fund the expansion. It allowed us to do key initial steps for implementation. So for things for being able to move forward with the hiring of, of 40 drivers and uh, to be able to purchase 43 uh, collection trucks and to be moving forward towards all the containers, there's, there's a lot of pieces to it. Jessica Toast says San Diego is still far behind many California counties and cities when it comes to municipal composting. She estimates San Diego County now has the capacity to compost only 30% of its food waste. Thomas Fudge, KPBS News.